Isotope RX is a great tool for dialog editors, and it's got all these awesome modules that uh, do a lot of the work for you. There's one way I really like to use Isotope, kind of like an, in an old school way. You know, in Pro Tools, if you were to select this, this noise right here, you're basically using a time domain. You're doing an in and an out, and you're copying and pasting fill. But the great thing about Isotope's spectral editor here is you're working in time and frequency domains. So I've got some boom bumps here. I'll just play this for you. So we want to keep all the breathing. Um, there's some Jenny hum in there that the mixer will take out. So you can hear these little, you can actually see them. There's one right here and one right here. Now if I did spectral repair, I'd have to mess with all these sliders and figure out what is the right setting for this. You can change all these things and it just, it, it's a lot of time that I don't have on this show. So what I'm going to do instead is, this one's pretty clear. There's a little footstep here that I want to keep. So, you know, regular fill paste wouldn't work there, but I'm going to take this piece of fill, just this frequency and time selection. See how that's a little chunk right there? And I should be able to just paste it over. And that So I'll do the same thing for this one. I don't know if you guys can hear this. It really depends on what you're listening on. But you can see these bumps down here. These are down at like 50, 60 hertz, which maybe the mixer will high pass. But you, as a dialogue editor, you, you, know, you don't assume that. You assume I got to get rid of these. So what I'll do here is grab some fill. I'm going to highlight just what I need. And actually, I'm going to get more surgical with this and just paint out this, go up here to get this, and keep the rest of that stuff. Now I'm going to do Shift Option V, and that should take care of the mic noise. There's still a little piece right here, so I'm going to zoom in and just get that piece. So Shift Option V, and let's listen to it and see if we actually got it out. Right in here, there's some. Now you have to be careful because once you start going up above where you grabbed your uh, tone from, it's just gonna pay silence and you're gonna end up with a big dropout. Now it's completely gone. Hopefully that helps you out.